Hello everybody. We still have two minutes to go, so we'll just wait till you're here, and then we will get the party started. No rush. No at all. Take your time, get yourself set. We won't start until we're all here and ready to work. You just need a mat, a bit of space, and then we're all. As always, keep some water nearby. Hi Paul, good to see you. If anybody else has arrived, feel free to say hello and we will get started in just over one minute's time. Oh, hello, we got five, that's good. Feel free to give us a wave, send us a comment, and we'll get started real soon. I'll wait until everybody's here before we begin, and then I'll talk you through what we're going to do, and how hard we're going to work, and then we're going to have some real fun. Good. Take your time, still got a minute before we begin. Make sure you've got your water and your towel nearby, and then we'll get started soon. If you want to put any comments in, any suggestions for future classes, anything you'd like us to do going forward, then send us a comment either now or afterwards and we will build from there. Because these are classes are for you, we want to give you some free time, something to take your mind off of the world to make it a little bit more fun. We'll give it another 30 seconds to see if anybody else wants to come and join us and then we'll get the party started. Looking good. Right, we're up to 10. That's good news. So my watch says 6 o'clock, so I'll just get started just now. All we need for this workout is a mat, plenty of space, your water bottle and your towel close by as well. If you have any injuries, I will show you some options to make the workout a little bit easier, or you can change it as required. If you're feeling a little bit under the weather, take the intensity down a touch, or feel free to sit out. This video will be available afterwards and you can do it at a later date. You may have seen the timetable that I put up this morning. We've got a lot more classes coming your way. Plenty more fun to get you involved. Any suggestions at any point, let us know and we will see what we can bring for you. How will we get that party started? So let's go with a nice easy jog in the toes and I'll talk you through what we're going to do. We've got a nice easy warm up to get us going. And then we've got 10 exercises, and the magic number we're going to do is 12. We're going to do 12 reps of each exercise, and we're aiming to do that three times through. The first time we'll take it nice and slow, we'll learn the moves, we'll feel how they work, show you the options. Round two, we'll pick up the pace, and round three, bang, 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 as fast as you can, maximum efforts. When you're ready, let's give the shoulders a roll, all the way up to the roof, and down. High as you can, try not to hit the roof, and then relax. Skids, reset, and we'll bring it the other way. Nice and high, all the way up, and all the way out. Just once more here. Well done. Give yourself a little cuddle if you can. One arm over, one arm under. Stretch out the chest, the shoulders, your upper back. Lengthen all those tight muscles from doing whatever it is you've been doing today. Good. So right, plant your feet for me. We're going to go for a nice big rotation. Turn your shoulders, turn your hips, open up through the lower body, the middle. Get that lower back nice and loose. One more time. Bring it back to the middle. We're going to hit the first squats of the day. And stand on up to the top. Nice and smooth. Sit down, stand up. In your own time, your own range. This is just the warm up. Let's not go too wild. All right, we're gonna add in a little heel raise. So as we come up out of the squats, come onto your toes. That way we lengthen up the hamstrings, your calves, and your bum, nice and tall at the top. Can you give me two more? One last time, and then hold it there. Good, right, so we're gonna hit some lunges. So pick a foot, long step back, and then same side, long stride. Sink down, push off, sink down, Push off. One more here. Swap it over. We'll do the same on the other side. 
Nice and smooth, down and up. Down and up. We wanna keep the upper body tall, strong through the core. One more here, and then hold it there. Right, we're gonna come down to the floor. We got some press ups for you. Nice and easy to start with. On your knees or your toes, hands nice and wide, down and up. If you wanna make it a little harder, come onto your toes and really focus on that range of motion. Just two more. Nice work. Hold at the top, staying on your toes. We're gonna to go for a mountain climber. One knee at a time, in towards your thumbs. Nice big squeeze. We're gonna go for six, four, two, and one. Good job. Come up onto your feet. Grab yourselves a quick drink. Hello, Neil. Hi, Kerry. Hi, Lynn. Hi, Andy. Nice to see you all. We ready to work hard? I hope so. Grab yourselves a quick drink and then come find me in the middle of your mat and we'll get this party started. So, 10 exercises, 12 reps each. First round, we're going to take it nice and slow just to learn the moves and then we'll build up some pace as we hit round two and three. So, first up, Nice and simple, 12 squats. So feet outside the hips, sit down, stand up. Smooth and steady. Let's focus on the range, the quality of the motion. Six more. Butt back, nice and low. Weight through the heels, push your hips forwards. Two, and one. Good. Now we make it into 12 squat jumps. Straight from one, to the next, landing soft, extend the hips, jump as high as you can. If you don't want to jump, just come up onto the toes. Remember, 12 is the target. One more for me, and then hold it there. Nice work. Right, back to the middle of the mat. Take one leg, step back, step in. That's one. We're going for 12. Sinking that back knee down towards your floor. Chest up nice and tall. We don't lean forwards. Stay up as tall as you can. And don't forget to breathe. I got three more here. One more time. And then guess what? Let's hit the other leg. Long step back and in. Center your body as much as you can. Don't lean over. As balanced and strong in the core as you can be. 12 is the target. And we got four more to go. Looking good. One more time. And then hold it there. Nice work. We're going to back it up. Come to the back of your mat. We're going to go for a walkout. So start at your toes. Walk your hands out till you're in a press up position. And then walk back in. Touch your toes. And do it again. That's two. And that's three. Remember team, your target is 12. So we start with the hamstrings nice and long. Walk it out. And walk it in. Walk it out. And walk it in. 12 times. Halfway. Let's get to the end. Small steps with your hands. Lengthen the hips and come all the way forwards. Nice and long. Back into the toes. Give me two more. On your last one, I want you to stay out on the floor. Down here. Good. Take a second. We're going to reset for some press ups. One hand in the middle, one hand out to the side. Press up. To the middle, to the other side. So we're going to walk it over. Nice and smooth, and we're going to go for 12. Six on each side. Kick it up onto the toes if you can. But remember, this is only round number one. So let's not get too wild too soon. Two more for Ian. Last one. Woo, come back to the middle. Nice work. Little pause. We're going to bring the elbows in for a narrow press up. So. You might want to start this on your knees. Tuck your elbows in, bring your chest down, push it away. 
your elbows should be touching your ribs. Bring your body down and push it away. Remember, 12 is the target. To make it easier, bring your knees under your hips and drop your elbows backwards towards the floor. Still keeping that narrow alignment. Two more. One more. And hold it there. Nice work. Stay here. We got some mountain climbers. On your toes, one knee in at a time. That's three. That's four. The quicker you move, the quicker it's over. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Nice work, team. Come on up. We got two moves to finish. Two good ones to get the heart and lungs cooking. We got some burpees. So feet nice and wide. We're going to squat down, hands on the floor, jump back, jump in, stand tall. That's one. Let's go for 12. The quicker you move, the harder it is. If you want, you can add a jump at the top. Or to make it a little easier, step one foot at a time out behind you. Nice and long, one foot at a time, and keep it moving. I'm going to go for three more. One last time. Nice work. Right, final move. We're going to go for a skater. I want you to jump over your mat. One big hop, side to side. Stick that landing. Use the arms if you can. Get a big swing. Up and over. Up and over. We're going to go for four, three, two, and one. Woo! Good work. That is round one done. Grab yourselves a quick drink. Reset. And we're going to do that all again. If you want to stick in any comments, how your press-ups were looking, how 12 burpees felt at the end of the workout, then fire away just now whilst we're recovering. And we're going to do it again. We're going to pick up the pace. We're going to try and move a little faster, but still maintaining that good quality movement. That is the key to success. Quality over quantity or speed. Slow it down if you need to. Once again, forgot to turn the heating off. It's getting a little warm in here. But hey, that beats being too cold. All right, we're ready for round two. How many reps are we doing? 12 reps. Just so you know, I can't see or hear any of you. If you write a comment, I can read it, but that's it. Just all I can see is me. So I am teaching me right now. Tell you what, I'm okay at this. Right, let's go. Squats. 12 times, nice and low. Sit back, push it out. If you can move a little quicker, Let's move a little quicker. Somebody's written something, keep going. Craig says it's a great idea. It is a great idea. Who doesn't love working out? I think that's 12. And let's go squat jumps, 12 times. Sit back, jump high. Focus on a nice soft landing, bending those knees. To make it easier, take out the jump and come up onto your toes like we did in the warm up. Three more. Two, and one. Good, right, back to the lunges. Pick a leg, step back, tap in. Two, three. Remember, 12 is what we're looking for. Get nice and low, load up that front foot, big push out the floor. Good, two more here. One more time. And we'll swap it over. Other side. Let's go. We want to minimize the rest to maximize the work. Short and sharp. That's what I said. Half an hour class to really get the heart rate going. Three. Two more. One last time. And bring it in. Right. So we hit the walkout. So come to the back of your mat. Touch your toes. Walk forwards. Lengthen out. And then back in. Let's make it nice and quick. 12 times. 
And as you reach that full extension, I want you to brace your core. Don't let your hips fall down. Nice and strong in here. Stable body, in and out. Keep it coming, team. Once you hit 12, we're going to stay out. We're going to hit the walk-in press-ups. Two to go. Last time. Nice work. Right, stay here. One hand in the middle. One hand wide. Down, up to the middle. Down, up to the middle. On your knees. On your toes. Now let's make it work. Fluid, continuous motion. Big squeeze. We got four. We got three. We got two. And we got one. Nice work. Little shake of the arms. Tuck those elbows in. And we go for the narrow press ups. So bring yourself forwards and down and push it away. Your elbows should be right in against your body. Tighten and drive it away. If that's too hard, as I said before, drop your bum back, elbows down, but keep them in nice and close. We go four, three, two, and one. Good. What's next? Mountain climbers. On your toes, pick a foot and count that leg. Four, five, six, seven, keep it coming. Nine, 10, 11, and 12. Good skills. Last two. Burpees first. Feet wide. Let's go. Sit down, jump back, jump in, and stand. The quicker you move, the quicker it's over. So let's get those legs. Those lungs pumping, I really dig deep. You're doing super duper well. If you want, add a jump at the top. Make it a little spicier. To make it easier, step one foot at a time, back and in. Two to go. One last time. Nice work. Last move, over your mat. One big jump. Stick the landing, I'm back. As big as you can, get your butt back, push it through. We got four, we got three, two, and one. Good work team. Two down, one to go. Grab yourselves a quick drink. We're gonna do that again. Little recovery. If you want to throw some abuse at me, now's your chance. I hope you're working hard. You're not sitting down on the sofa, because we still got one more round to do. And this one, we're gonna go fast, fast, fast. That is us halfway through, or half an hour window. So, and we're not finished after this. We got a little bit of floor work to do. So. Who's ready? Final round. 12 times. The quicker we go, the quicker it's over. Where do we start? 12 squats. Yeah, I am struggling. Yeah, and the heating is definitely still on Neil. Alright, this is it. 12 squats. Let's go. Down and up. Quick as you can, but focus on that range. Nice and low. Looking good. If you're feeling the heat and you're sweating, that's good. That's why we're here. One more time. And we go straight into the squat jumps. Let's go. Jump high. Land soft. As you come down, get your feet flat on the floor. Big push through. Looking good. Looking good. Four more. Keep it coming. Two. And one, right, straight into the lunges, let's go. One, and two. Do not sacrifice the range. If you're struggling, slow it down. Quality comes first. If you're feeling good, then what are you waiting for? Let's pick up the pace. If you wanna go faster than me, go faster than me. One more here, 
Quick change, other side. Ooh, hello legs. It's getting a little hot here. Ah, that's good. Keep it coming. I've got another four to do. Right the way through. Two, and one. Nice work. Back it up. Walk out from the back of the mat. Touch your toes, walk out. Walk in, let's go. No hanging around. Quick remove. Quicker it's over. Woo! You're doing great. Focus on trying to stay within the lines of your mat. Don't let your body wander. Keeping your core braced. Nice and stable. Four to go. Last two, quick as you can, like you're running on hot coals. In and out real fast. Oh, I forgot to stay out. Back out we go, one more for good luck. Let's walk those press ups. One hand in the middle, and then swap it over. This is the last set of press ups, so let's make it count. Low, and then back up nice and quick. Big push, big push. We got four, three, two, and one. Nice work. Sit back, a little shake. We bring it in narrow. Knees or toes? Knees is easier. If you can manage toes, go toes. Chest, right down to the floor. Big, big push away. We're almost there. Give me four. Come on, don't give up. Two to go. Last one. And hold. Nice work. Quick shake. Mountain climbers. 12. Count one foot. In and out. Just like that, you're halfway. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice work. Take a second. 12 burpees. As fast as you can. Let's go. Out and in. Nice and quick. I want you to snap those feet in with a little bit of purpose. Drive those knees forwards. Pop to the top. If you want to jump, jump. Whatever we do, we're moving fast. Four to go. Looking good. Give me two. And one. Nice work. Right, final move. Side to side. Up and over. Big push. Make it quick. That's six. Keep it coming. Four. Three. Two. And one. Good work. Right, hold it there. We're going to bring it down. Grab a drink. Send me some abuse if you like. Or some constructive comments. We're gonna, I'm gonna turn my mat so you can see me a little better. And we're gonna finish off with a bit of core work. No rush, none at all. Take your time. Uh, it's using a dishcloth instead of a sweat towel. Better not tell the wife. Right, what's the magic number? 12, we got four core moves, back to back, 12 reps on each, yeah? We're gonna work in here, the whole way around. The full trunk, all the muscles in and around the core that help us keep stable and powerful, generate that speed out of the floor when we're doing burpees and press ups and whatnot. It's getting a little warm in here, I quite agree. Right, let's finish this. Hit the deck, sit on your bum for me, as if you're gonna do a seated twist. Nice and tall, I want you to lean back till your feet come up off the floor. Find that balance point. From there, extend your legs, lean back, and bring it in. Out and in, out and in. Remember, 12 is your target. Easier option, feet down, and just a little lean back, yeah? 
Let's go for six. We really want to engage that core, but focus on keeping your upper body nice and tall. Yeah? Three, and two, and one. Spot on. Good. Come on to your back for me. Make yourself as long as you can be. Two arms, one leg, coming up into the middle, and back. As high as you can, reaching towards those toes. We're going to go for six on each side. Twelve in total. To make it a little easier, bend your knee and just bring it in towards the middle. If you want to go higher, go higher. Just one more here for me. Big push up. And out. Nice work. Okay. On to your front. Plank position. Arms parallel. We're going to go for a side plank rotation. So we keep nice and square. Then we're going to turn the whole body to the side of the room and back. Do that again. Same side. To make it easier, drop that bottom knee to the floor and just rotate from there. Six on this side. And then six going the other way. So we come back to the middle, we reset, and we open up going the other way. Nice and square, and breathe. Two more. One last time. And come back to the middle, and hold. Good. One down, two to go. Let's try that all again. Take a seat. We don't want to hang around. We've only got six minutes to finish this. So, nice and slow, lean back, kick it out, and pull it in. Kick it out, pull it in. Focus on your breathing. Try not to hold your breath. If you want to make it harder, reach out. Nice and long. If you want to make it easier, feet down and just lean back. Two. And one. Woo! On your back. Make yourself as tall as you can be. Bring yourself up in towards your toes. High as you can. The higher the better. Option. Bend the knee. Push from there. Twelve in total. And we've got four more. Big push. Four. Three. Two. And one. Good. On to your front. Side plank. Finish round two. Stack those arms up. And let's go. One. Two. Turn your whole body, shoulders and hips, to face the side. Two more. One more time. Come back to the middle. And take it the other way. Keep it moving, nice and smooth. Remember, you can drop that bottom knee if you need to make it easier. Two more. Last time. And hold, right? Take a second, shake it out. Once more. Then we're done. Take a seat. On your bum, sit up tall. Lean back until those feet are in the air. Kick it out, pull it in. Kick it out, pull it in. Focus on your breathing. Let's get this finished. That's halfway. Six, five. Come on, keep it going. Should be getting a little bit tough by now, but we're almost there. One more. And hold. Good. Flat on your back. Arms out. Reach high. Push through, aiming for those toes. Remember, you can take that option at any point you need, but let's keep going. That's us halfway, six more. Aim for the roof, try and touch your toes if you can. Three, two, and one. This is it. Plank rotations to finish, quick as you can. On your front, forearms parallel, rotates open, and back down. Same side. Keep your bum down, your shoulders forwards. 
Two more here. One more time. Reset in the middle. Take six the other way. Keep it coming. We are almost finished. Final three. All the way to the end. One last time. Bring it in. And hold. Woo! Nice work. We are finished. Take your time. Stand up, grab yourselves a quick drink, and we're gonna stretch real soon to finish. You did super duper well. If you get any questions or comments, stick them in just now. Whilst I'm getting a quick drink, then we'll stretch. Then you can go enjoy the rest of your Thursday night. You did super duper well. Short and sharp. I know we're all feeling a little bit cabin fever-esque, but that's okay, because with this little bit of space, uh, we can all have a little bit of fun. No reason we can't work hard. You're most welcome, Neil. Glad you enjoyed it, and I hope you work hard. Got a little bit of sweat in your head as well. When you're ready, find a little bit of space in your mat. Give your arms a shake. One arm up and over. Gently pull your elbow and point your fingers down your spine. Just breathe, relax, and the other side. Keeping that elbow as high as you can, point your fingers down. You're welcome, Carrie. It's good to have you. Let's take that arm across the front of your body. Pull it over. Try and keep yourself square. Don't pull yourself around. Nice and strong, stable in the front. And the other side. Bring your fingers together in front, tune your chest, reach it forwards as far as you can, stretch out the upper back, and then roll it up nice and tall. Bring your shoulders up, back, and down. Nice. Take a second, find your balance, grab a foot, heel to bum, knees together. Lift your hips forward. Just trying to stay as tall as you can to lengthen out that quad. They've done a lot of work tonight. You've done a lot of work tonight. So take good care of yourself. Stretch, drink plenty of water. And make sure you recover well, ready for tomorrow's class. All right, take that foot for me. Step it in front, sit your bum back, and lean into your hamstring. <laughs> Yeah, Carol, bring your neighbours in. The more, the merrier. Got to remember for tomorrow to not put the heating on so early. The other side, step through, sit back, lean into the back of that leg, stretch out the hamstring, bring your toes up, take a stretch into your calf. Good, last move we'll do. Take your feet nice and wide. You're going to give me a deep squat, and as you rise, bring your arms up overhead. Breathe in. And breathe out. So we're going to go for two more. One last time. And at the top, bring your hands together and give yourself a round of applause. You did super duper well. I hope you had fun. Any questions, comments, any kind of feedback you want to give us, it would be great. We're pretty new at this. This is only class number two. So if there's anything in particular you want to see that we can bring for you, different times of the day, different structures, let us know and we'll see what we can do. Next class is tomorrow at half past four. We're going to bring in you a little bit of stretching, a little bit more mobility. It'll be much more slower paced, more fun, more relaxed. Maybe not more fun, but a different kind of way. But anyway, enjoy your Thursday.